you are just a beginner, this workout is perfect for you. Express abs. Will, it will take you about six minutes and we'll do five exercises, two rounds. You will do this in no time. If you're just starting, you might feel a little bit hard at the beginning, but keep pushing yourself because you will see results very, very quickly. So the first exercise you're going to do is crunches, but you're going to bring your forearms to the floor, extend the legs and then bring your knees towards your chest. When you do this, make sure that you are engaging your abs. So you should feel that your abs are working. Extend the legs, don't let your legs touch the floor. And then bring towards your chest. And you're going to do this for 15 repetitions. Second exercise, bring the legs straight up. Then you're going to bring one leg down towards the floor. The other one stays up and then keep alternating from side to side. And again, 15 each leg. So it should be around 30 when completed. Good, well done, good job. And again, keep engaging your abs while you're doing the exercise. Now next one, forearms are still on the floor. With your legs straight up, bring them forward and then scoop with your both of your legs so as you extend bend the knees and bring the heels towards your butt and then repeat this motion again for 15 keep engaging your abs so belly button is in lower back is on the floor good moving on to the fourth one lie down on the floor with your hands on your thighs you're going to slide your hands along your thighs towards the top of your knees Okay. So lift the shoulder blades off the floor and engage your abs, bring belly button in and the lower back should be on the floor, pressing down on the floor, 15 repetitions. And then what next one you're going to do air cycling. So just imagine you're cycling, but do this while lying down on the floor. And here you can change the way you move the legs. So you can start by cycling with your legs straight up and then starting to move your legs down towards the mat until you are cycling very close to the floor and then again back to the top. Okay. When you finish your first round, take a break, hug your knees, just do a pause and just get ready for the second round. Okay. So if you're ready for the second round, start again on the first exercise. Four arms on the floor, legs straight up, and then crunch, bring your knees towards your chest. If you're doing these outside, while you're doing the exercise, just enjoy you know, the sounds, the nature around you. If you're doing at home, also have fun with it. Second exercise, keep alternating from side to side, legs straight up. Good. And on this exercise, if you, if you want to, you can also lie down on the mat. So you can change. Good. Third exercise, same here, continue to engage your abs. If you need to, just lie down on the floor. And this series of exercises are really good to add to your workout. If you've done uh, weights, strength training, or maybe at the end of your yoga or pilates session. Good. Lie down on the floor, fourth exercise. Good. With your hands on your thighs, just let your hands slide up towards your knees. Keep bringing belly button in and pressing lower back on the floor.
do 15 of this. And get ready for the final one, cycling. So if you start with the leg straight up, continue to cycle while you lower the legs and then bring them up again. So on this video I did five of this, cycling from the top to the bottom and again from the top to the bottom. And if you want the extra challenge, of course, add a third round. But make sure to do this at least three times a week. And when I'm finished, just bring your knees to your chest, have a break, and congratulate yourself for your workout. Well done. Well done for your workout. Let me know in the comments how it went. Do this at least for two weeks straight and come back and let me know in the comments with your results. Bye for now.